action. Hello guys, uh, trying to review this ER shark. This is the fourth time we're now recording this. And the reason we're having a problem is because this is just not a very easy uh, item to review. Um, there's a lot of problems, a lot of things that uh, exist in the industry. Uh, that make hurdles for people to use old gear and this tries to solve one of them but in reality um, it doesn't really offer too much um, what it does is it converts an EARC output from the TV and it goes into here it goes into via an HDMI channel and it outputs an optical and a analog and an HDMI and EARC for some reason is different than HDMI the standard um, so this converts the EARC into an HDMI connector and that HDMI will be uh, 2.1 compatible which means it will support uh, Atmos true HD and master audio uh, one thing that you need to know is that the optical on this does not support master audio, Atmos, and other things. And that's one of the problems that this tries to solve, is that uh, this promises you that you can take it, an old system, and plug it in that supports True HD, that supports MA, and you can plug this in and it would work is great i mean we do vintage audio you know we can use our old receiver and try to that we like and that sounds good um and we still can benefit from master audio and use the latest technologies the latest resolutions and things like that um, but ultimately the problem isn't even with this device it's with everybody else uh, most of the time, and Blu-rays have two outputs on a HDMI, and you can get around the problem with that. If you buy a Blu-ray with two HDMIs, and that's one of the few true audio sources and master audio sources that you're actually going to encounter. Anything you play on Netflix, any of the streaming services will most likely be compressed audio. And all of the compressed audio can therefore be covered by the optical that is most likely already on your TV. And that is also covered by most of those re older receivers. So ultimately, this is a $220 item. I think I paid $200, $200 uh, dollars for this. That really never benefited me one little bit. I never was able to enjoy true audio or master audio through this device. And I ultimately just could have used this because my TV didn't even support the standards that this would support and tries to give me backwards compatibility with. It does do a wonderful job at converting EARC into an HDMI channel. So if you have a problem using optical and maybe you need something like this if the tvs start coming out and the streaming services start coming out with higher quality sound a device like this would be helpful but there's a reason why the tvs are not outputting hdmi they use this earc property and that's because they really want you to go buy new equipment and they also are trying to keep the copyright protection down so that they keep people from copying the movies. Um, but ultimately, it just doesn't do very much. And therefore, I just can't really recommend it. I wish I'd even pay for it, honestly. I bought it and I thought it would help me play HD and MA audio on my old Arkham uh, receiver. And uh, I found out that my TV wouldn't even pass that through it. 
I uh, would filter it out before it even got into the EARC. And I own a, a uh, Samsung TV, so I think that this is a no buy. And I can't recommend it. And I can't suggest anybody buys this unless they have a very specific purpose and that is to use old equipment and they have a source that will play the HD and MA audio that we're looking for. I am a big proponent of non-compressed audio and I wish the optical would have had the bandwidth for it. But unfortunately, we're still stuck with HDMI and the TV manufacturers just don't seem to care about our audio. Um, so thank you very much. Uh, my recommendation would be to use your optical on your TV and don't use one of these. Just save yourself the money. Buy a Blu-ray with two HDMI outputs, plug one of them in your old receiver and use that. Um, there's no other situations you're really gonna run into MA and HD audio. And really that's the only reason you would need this. Thank you.